Today's video is sponsored by Currently, delivering EV charging to you at home, the office, or wherever you want. Get 30 days of EV charging delivery service for free by using the code EVOLVED at the link below. If you've been watching this channel since 2017, you'll know that my daily driver has been Artemis, a 2017 Chevrolet Bolt EV. My partner also has a 2017 Chevrolet Bolt EV called Orion, but today I finally exchange Artemis for Adira Tull, a 2022 Ford F-150 Lightning Lariat extended range. And you and I, we're gonna unbox it together. Cause the first thing that everybody wants to see with the F-150 is the frunk. Now, this truck has not been touched. The dealer went down to the rail yard this morning and picked Adira Tal up. They have not washed the truck, so all the dirt that you are seeing has basically come from Adira Tal's travels from the factory to here. Tomorrow we are going to get the truck ceramic coated, so this really is literally just as the truck arrived they've made sure that it's working they've connected a computer to it but that's about it let's see what's inside so this is a, a front license plate holder just go on here somewhere so that's cool we'll be putting that on later then we have this is the divider for the front trunk. You see it's got cup holders on one side and a measure in inches. The other side is completely unmolested as it were. Then what have we got here? Ah, we have what looks like a cargo mat. I don't know what this is. It's a random little thing just sitting here. We'll come back to that in a minute. I think it might be a spare one of these push pins that you use to secure the trim pieces down. There's also a bottle cap, a motorcraft bottle cap. This is what happens sometimes. Uh, and then here, oh, look at this. We have what looks like a cargo net for the front of the truck, which is very nice. I didn't know we were going to get a cargo net, so that's cool. This is a bag of goodies. It feels a little bit like the holidays. It really does. Very expensive holiday. $80,000 expensive holiday. This is the Ford mobile charging connector. It comes in this very nice bag. This has got a rougher surface to it. And I think that is so that it doesn't slide around. You've got a nice little uh, warning label there which I think is pertaining to how you put the, the connectors in here. So this is the, the unit here. It's capable of up to 32 amps at 240 volts. And you have a, this looks like a NEMA 1450 adapter. There you go, a NEMA 1450 adapter. Everything's a little damp. It's a bit weird. I guess because of the moisture, because this has been on a train for the last week and a half. And then on this side, we get a granny lead because, you know, every granny drives a Ford F-150 Lightning apparently. So this is your granny lead. This connects into the top of the charger. And I hope, I'm not sure if it will, but I hope in the future people actually uh, someone comes up with alternatives so that you can plug this in and charge from other socket types as you are making your trips out and about of course this does have rapid charging 170 kilowatts dc quick charging capability for the extended range truck although on paper ford does say 150 kilowatts so that's a bit different let us put this over here and maybe put that back in the bag later. Then we have this. Now this is really important. This is a special charge coupler and we're going to go around the back of the truck in a second and I will show you what this is for. So I'm going to pop this in my hoodie pocket here on this side. 
And then, as everybody else got in a little fancy black bag, appropriate to the car, we have a Tesla adapter. So if you want to charge your friend's stranded Tesla, you can. I don't know whether this was trolling or excellent marketing, but I, I just think it's funny. Uh, so now if you have a Tesla, I can come and rescue you. Maybe. There are some interesting little uh, quirks and features, to use a Doug DeMuro term here. You've got the Made in the USA here with a drain plug, so you can fill this up with ice if you want. You can get to your battery in the back there, but there's also jumper start terminals here on this, uh, this front side here. Of course, you've got your washer fluid, and here, inside, you've got your power, your onboard power. You've got USB-A, USB-C, you've got four 110 volt 20 amp circuits. You've also got your, your hooks for carrying your bags. I'm not very impressed at the trim finish of that. That, that is not really the fitting of a truck of this size. So let's, let's note this one to tell the, uh, the dealership before we go away. And this one is a bit loose as well. So two of them are nice, two of them are loose. We'll come back to that in a second. I'm going to put this back in the truck and then uh, we can put the lid down. There are buttons here that you can use to shut the, uh, the bonnet. Or you can press this twice on the, uh, on the key fob. Or you can close it from inside. So let's do it like this. Down it goes. There's more from our unboxing of our Ford F-150 Lightning in a second, but first a message from today's video sponsors. Currently, they'll help you stay charged up wherever you are. Currently is an EV charging delivery app that brings your electric car the power it needs wherever you happen to be. Currently operating in Los Angeles, San Francisco, San Jose and Dallas, currently can help you bust rapid charging queues and ensure that you've got the charge you need to get where you want, when you want. And it means you can finally own an EV with confidence, even if you don't have off-street charging and parking at home. With plans starting from under $5 a month, there are a range of currently plans to help you dump the pump and stay charged up. Simply download the Currently app and give it a go. Tell Currently what your car is, how much charge you need, and Currently's trained drivers do the rest, delivering your EV a rapid charge wherever your car is, and there's no need to be with your vehicle. Transport Evolved viewers can get a 30-day free EV charging trial with Currently by using the promo code EVOLVED when setting up your account. Give them a try today by downloading the app, and thanks to Currently for sponsoring this unboxing video. So at the rear of the truck, you've got multiple ways to get this tailgate down. It does come down of its own free will. And you can push it back up either by doing it manually, getting it to about here, and then the truck will take over. Or you can do it with the remote. Et voila. Uh, we did not buy a bed cover for this truck. We decided that what we were going to do instead was to use a bed rug. So this is now how you get into the truck. Now, we are going to put a bed rug in. We've already ordered it. It's on the way. All of the F-150 Lightning Lariats come with the box system, so you can put attachments on. And of course here, you've got more power. So you've got AC, 110 volts, and then here, you've got the big boy. And that is so that you can run a NEMA 1450 And you can run a regular NEMA 1450 from that. You can press that button and it will turn on the power for the bed. Thank you to Tonkin in Hillsborough for not literally 
touching this car because it means that we can set everything up. I am the first person to take this off. All right. So we have to take the film off. I know that my partner really likes removing film from things. So would you like to do the honors? <laughs> All right, here goes. Let's move the seat forward so I can actually reach. Let's turn the truck on. Nice. So we've got the little blue cruise um, sensor there and then there's another one here. Let's turn the radio off. Now we haven't paired the truck with our phones. And we haven't turned on the truck yet, so we're going to get our, our Ford Pass app out. And we're going to try and activate this vehicle. Looks like it's already been activated, actually. Oh, no. Activate vehicle. Uh, restore previous data. All right. We're going to activate the vehicle. It might take up to 90 seconds. So what we're doing here is we're activating this vehicle with this and it says enable Ford Pass connected services, uh, start vehicle, blah, blah, blah. Yes. I think I just said yes. Did it? Oh, yes. Yes. Okay. Congratulations. Your Ford Pass Connect has been activated. Please wipe while we enable other Ford Pass Connect services on this vehicle. There's things like um, whether you are going to be able to unlock and lock the vehicle. Eventually, phone is a key, so you can actually start the truck automatically just by having your key. You have been authorized to access Adir Atal. So my truck is now here. And if I go to here, come on. Hopefully it will refresh in a second. I can, I can turn on my horns and my lights. I can start the truck. I can lock, uh, sorry, unlock and lock the truck. And I can also activate my blue charge network. Let's talk about this up here. So we have a massive full length roof that is um, tilt and slide which gives you access obviously to outside and then I can close this with one touch and I can close or open that uh, that area there. Now my partner and I have been talking about this a lot. We're talking about the gear lever and how everybody shows the foldy thing so that you can then do this but i think everybody's seen that so we waited until later on for everybody to see that things that are more interesting to me is the wireless phone charging space down there which allows my phone to charge and of course allowing my truck to access uh, my phone so i can have carplay while i'm in the vehicle that to me is more important than everything else but there are some other cool features I'm sure we'll figure out as we go through. We'll make some more videos about this. Uh, you've got the various modes, so normal, sport, off-road, tow, haul. You have onboard scales, so if somebody was to get in the back of the truck, you'd be able to see how heavy it was. Right now, uh, we don't have any excess weight in the truck. Our maximum uh, GVR weight for the truck is 1725. We also have Smart Hitch, which allows us to figure out how um how much weight we're towing uh, we've got some towing settings here i need to go through all of these we've got some wonderful cameras um in the truck here and uh, we've got one uh that allows us to see into the bed we've got side ones and also ones going forwards i need to play with this configuration and see exactly which way around it works but i think that is it for this unboxing video. I should probably show you the back, but we also have a pretty nice feature in the back here. We can do this. 
if I retract the seatbelts. <laughs> we can actually fold this up. This is collapsible. It's got a nice load liner in it. So we can actually collapse this by pulling this lever here, folding it down, and then we've got some storage space or we can have it upright. Just pull it into place on that side. And then we pull this lever up. There we go. Uh, and then I'm gonna pull the seats back down. So there you have it. And of course, this. That is it. That is Adiratal. There's gonna be more videos coming in the next few days, I am sure, probably a few weeks, because we've got a test drive event in Utah to go to and a couple of other things, but don't worry. We're gonna be doing a whole lot more with this truck. It is going to be the Transport Evolved main vehicle. We're gonna load it up with camera gear and all kinds of other fun stuff. Obviously we need to put the bed rug in and we also need to put a tonneau cover on. So all of those videos will be feature videos on this channel. That is it for today. If you liked the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and also do share it with your friends, family, co-workers, even your mortal enemies. That's good. Leave your thoughts below in the comments or in our Discord chat room. It is free to join the Discord chat room. Our only request is that you keep things civil. Be nice to each other. If you want a more generalized news roundup rather than me going, oh my God, I just got a new truck. Do make sure that you check out our TEN News Roundup show. That happens every weekend on this channel. And we've got great loads of other content for you all to enjoy, including me saying goodbye to Artemis our Chevrolet Bolt. And there is a twist in the tale that I will come to at some point in the future that I will tell you about, but not right now. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to this channel and our other channel, Transport Default Take Two, and give the bell a gentle ding to make sure that you know when our next video goes live. Also, thanks on behalf of the entire TE crew, to the folks on my right for being our $15 to $49 a month supporters. Special thanks to our $50 a month patrons. They are Chris Maxwell, Pedro Muro Pinheiro, Patrick Boyarski, Bennett Elder, Brian Newton, Dave Kitchen, Michael Goad, Ricky Leon, Andrew Martin, Guido Drahota, Brophy Wolf, Tesla in the Gong, Gordon C, Stephen O'Donoghue, Carl Hodgson, uh, Anthony Coates, Raging Fellows, Jim Vaness, Chris Ascentar, Chris and Michael Johnson, Peter Dillinger and Denny Hyde. And of course, our deepest gratitude to our top tier supporters. Anonymous Freak, Marcel Ward, Reggie Watts, Rory Litwin, Joe Bresney, Reed R, JP Fagerback, Russ, Will Graylin, Matthew Drobnak, John Lyons, Andrew Glenn, Paul Conway, Laura Reynolds, Ellery Hensley, someone else, Ian and Ian. I will be back with more awesome content, but if you would like to support the channel and join that amazing list of people, you can do so by following the link to Patreon in the, uh, in the section below the description. Also, you can hit the join button. That also helps to join the channel on YouTube, or you can send us some money through Ko-fi, Bitcoin, or by buying something from our cool swag store, like some of the new t-shirt designs you've got in. I'm sure there'll be some F-150 Lightning t-shirts coming into the store very soon. I will, I will make sure of it. Until then, thanks for joining me. Thanks for putting up with the slightly excited video. Thank you again to Tonkin Ford in Hillsborough for letting us film this. We got this truck before they even got their demonstrator. So they did help me a little bit to make sure that the truck arrived in one piece. We did not pay over. We did not get in special treatment. We did pay full list price for this truck. Made possible thanks to you guys at home if you are Patreon supporters, by the way and there will be more content coming very soon but also before i go check out currently it is a great system i would love to hear how you find it if you live in one of the cities where currently currently operates currently currently operates i'm sure there's a better way of me saying that do give the service a try and leave your experiences in the comments below thanks for joining me and as always keep evolving